to World Health, uh, www.worldhealth.net and sign up for the electronic biotech newsletter. But our EBN has an opt-in subscription list of uh, over 500,000. Sure. So, uh, yeah, over and most of these, Yeah, and most of these guys are health professionals. It's amazing. Yeah, so and that brings you back. What we have is we have a worldwide phenomenon of hundreds of thousands of physicians uh, who control the, the, the health care programs of tens of millions of patients, maybe sure. hundreds of millions of patients. And these people are going for anti-aging medicine, you know, with, with, with you know, full speed ahead. And many of them uh, uh, are, most of them actually, are overseas. It's amazing. I just don't understand why we are so behind the times well, in the United and States. It, and it, we're, brings, we're it, just, it. it just brings back that dichotomy that we uh, talked about very early in the program here, how, uh, I mean, you have 500,000 people opting into the EU Biotech newsletter, and we've got uh, people donating millions of dollars to the Methuselah Foundation. Uh, there seems to be a big push for uh, anti-aging, real anti-aging research and real anti-aging medicine. However, uh, it seems governments are a little behind the times. Now, of course, that happens. It seems uh, quite a bit that the government is a little bit behind the times. But uh, don't you think that there's a little bit of a tipping point here with so many people and, say, uh, also because of the baby boomers uh, advancing in age? And they I don't believe the government at all behind the times. I believe that uh, they're getting exactly what they want, and they have an agenda. Oh, oh, you you think it's a it's a control issue then, basically? I am For, convinced of it. That that is a big. Why else would you? Why else would you try and and and, and consign and, people to an early death? Why would so you, much yeah. money trying to suppress the advancement of biotechnology that is so clearly in favor of humanity. Yeah. Well, you know what, uh, Dr. Klatz here, I, there, were, there are a few people asking some questions in the chat, and I did inform them that you would uh, uh, kind of participate in that chat a little bit, so, uh, and we're and already... I'm going to have to book you out of here in about 10 minutes. 10 so minutes, okay, so uh, we'll uh, stop the official interview here, I'll hang up this call, but, uh, and so you can answer a couple of those questions that have been occurring in the chat there. Uh, and I just want to thank you very much, and I want to thank uh, the American Academy of Anti-Aging Medicine for all your hard work out there uh, helping to extend uh, the healthy lives of people around the world. Uh, well, it was, it's my pleasure, and I want to thank you for uh, helping to educate the public as well and, and your work in supporting research. And, uh, you know, well, we do our best. We're all awesome. together, like it or not. We're all dying from the same we horrible are. disease that's aging. And, but together we can make some difference, and, and, and I think that together we have. I, I think you're right, and I think if we continue to work together in the future, we'll see some uh, big progress. Okay, well, great. All right. Uh, thank and you very much. Yep, thank you very much, Dr. Klatz. And now uh, he will uh, answer a couple of questions in the chat room. So stick around. <laughs> Okay, everyone uh, giving some thank yous here. I'll, I'll keep the rotating uh, pictures there. Okay, Dr. Klatz is uh, 65321 uh, in the Ustream here. So he did have some questions. Uh, who is Alan Mintz? Someone asked, uh, what do you think of the death of Dr. Alan Mintz? And that's a name I'm not, uh, not too familiar with, Dr. Mintz. I'll have to look it up here. I'm going to take a look. Was he? He must have been an anti-aging, uh, a longevity expert. Oh, okay. Well, okay. So now you can hear me typing on the UStream channel. <laughs> I'm going to turn off the audio then uh, in the Ustream channel here so everyone can participate in the chat. And I want to thank everyone for stopping by this evening. A great chat uh, with Dr. Klatz. Boy, he uh, had a lot of good information. And uh, like he said, hopefully, you know, we'll all be uh, seeing some real advances in anti-aging medicine uh, in the near future. I'm just going to turn off the audio here for a little bit uh, after Dr. Klatz takes off. Uh, then we'll have a little uh, chilling time, uh, talk about the program, uh, let me know. Yeah, I always like to get some feedback, so I'll be sticking around, but I'm going to turn off the audio here uh, just for the time being while we focus on the chat.